Greetings guys and girls, fellow gamers, my name is Gensu Kicks and welcome back to Humanity, our actual start now of our playthrough. Played a kind of first impressions video of it and didn't figure out everything, but I did play quite a while afterwards um, since the stream and um, we also had a little bit of a, a kind of quick session uh, during one of our attempted pay Payday 3 streams when Payday 3 just wasn't loading, we just basically ended up playing humanity sea for a little while um, just to have some fun and uh, to kill the waiting time and that stream has been deleted because it was just nonsense in the end but um, yeah so we now have our proper so that's our payday 3 session we have our proper uh, start now um, of our playthrough so we're gonna go take our character I love that you can save your character let's actually change his t-shirt a little bit so we know it's different Yeah, let's go with that. Set. Excellent. Oh, it always changes beard color when I click set. That is something very interesting. Like after I change the top or something. So if I click set now, I think now it's saved. Yeah, now everything is saved. Very strange. Okay, so let's do it properly. Kickstopia, start game. No, we do not need the tutorial. Now, um, uh, I was going considering to go really hardcore, like uh, not from the difficulty, but from like, you know, respawn on loot, things like that. So what I'm gonna do instead is I'm gonna leave airdrops every three days, like in seven days to die. I'm gonna leave loot, I'm gonna leave everything default, um, except let's make the loot respawn timer quite long so that we actually have to go out but eventually kind of something actually you know what let's let like in seven days to die let's just turn it off and see how it goes um clear infection on death oh that's interesting that's new i don't think i've seen that before by design when you die with infection you will respawn with that infection okay that makes no sense uh, to me so because then you just die again and die again so I know it means you can use death as an excuse, but we're not trying to die on purpose. Um, zombie difficulty, we leave everything on normal. AI difficulty, what is AI difficulty? Not really sure what that means. What's the difference between zombie difficulty and AI difficulty? Unless there's human enemies as well, I guess. Okay starting season so we usually start in spring but the problem with spring is it seems to always go to winter so we're gonna start in summer and hopefully that will be better um days per season um yeah i don't know we leave that default i haven't I, I haven't got a feeling yet um you know what the game is like so we're gonna go for as much day as possible vital drain that was added as well what is vital drain Huh. I think that's new as well since we last played. Okay, let's leave it like that. I think they're, they're good settings. Um, Nifo, how are you? Welcome to the stream. Oh, Genie Maki, give me a heart attack, dog. Why are you doing this to me? Do you want me to die before the zombie apocalypse? It would be your fault. You have to feed on my cadaver until the, the rest of the family comes home. Oh, my Genie Maki. Okay, so um, I'm kind of tempted to go through all the maps and start, um, you know, on the easy one, you know, the starter one. Um, it gives you all you need to begin surviving, improvised backpack to help carry more items, improvised hammer. We can build these very easily. Um, lots of lootable containers. That might be good. But... I did like um, the inland spawn. That was when we started before. Coast road spawn, west road spawn. Yeah, let's let's go with the coast road spawn. Let's do that. It's just the number of zombies I'm a little bit worried about, but we should be okay. I think we should have lowered the loot, actually, to... Uh, unless it was balanced. I see they made some changes. So, why are you doing this to me, though? Why? Why? Why are you barking? You, you haven't made a sound all night. And now, you, now you, you're terrifying me. Oh, stone. Nice. 
Okay, so we start off with very little. Um, where's our house? Like, what's the house we want to start in? Like, this is the garage, so I assume let's go into the house straight up, I guess. Oh, this is a lot of room. Is that the SUV we can drive? No, but we can drive this, I guess. Okay, if we can repair this, we might as well. Um... Ah, there's no room, though. That's typical. The car was everything. Okay. Well, for the moment, let's just put the letter in there. We don't need to read the letter anymore. We're fine. Um, yeah, so let's just make sure we take all the stones and stuff. I think the thing is reset. Hang on a second. The cursor color, cursor size, controller surface. No, not the rotation. What, what is it? Um, there was something was inverting the zoom. Inverting the zoom. Yeah, there. Thank you. Uh, actually, to me, this is the other way around. They call it inverting zoom, but I think it's completely the opposite way around. Um, also, we can change the color of the cursor. Oh, blue. That's nice. Okay. Apply and save. So basically, um, when I zoom, when I scroll my mouse forward, it actually zooms out. And when I uh, move my mouse backwards, like my scroll wheel to me, it zooms in and that is the default so i have to go to inversion to actually zoom out when i go back and zoom in when i go forward which is actually what the normal default should be in the first place so they call that inversion but to me it's the other way around the inversion is what should be the, the default which i think is the default with most games so that's why uh, i was a little confused when they called it inversion i was like okay you have been an inversion Set map to flat. Yes, that would be really the best way so we can build the best bases. Uh, no toilet gun. Oh, we got a rag. That's very good, actually. That rag is very good. I can see a gun, so let's actually equip the hat. The t-shirt is going to be very good to rip stuff up. So let's put that straight in the car. That's going to be our storage for everything. Oh, loads of clothes. Okay. Um, where are the gloves? Okay. Oh, yeah. This is another thing that's very confusing. It's a, it suffers a little bit from the seven days to die uh, issue where the action keys to do certain things changes. For example, you're in this menu, equip is right click. So you go, hey, equip, right click. I go into my inventory, guess what? Right click is drop and left is equip. <laughs> it's like, why? <laughs> Uh, so, 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 so you get used to right clicking to equip and then every time you're in your inventory you drop everything on the floor so yeah it's it's something you have to get used to like uh, seven days to die suffers from the same problem um, so let's see um, we have here okay, we have a gun that's actually really good and um, that went into our equipment slot so we might actually be able to pick up everything Now, there's no bullets in it, as far as I know. Yeah, when you find them, the I don't think there's ever any bullets in there. Okay, and I think we got that. Okay. Now we're gonna have to make some basic tools and weapons. 
Let's put the weapon away. We don't need it. And let's put all these clothes away. Excellent. Okay, so let's see actually what's in the barn. Yeah, I can turn the speed down a little bit more on the uh, rotation. Um, sure. Yeah, that's a little better. There's a backpack, actually. That's pretty cool. Let's see. Nothing in it, though. Oh, nice. We got a hammer now. Building options. That's actually awesome. So we don't need to build our own hammer. Um, usually we do an improvised hammer, but now we don't need to. That's really good. Oh, wow. A biker helmet. Much better protection than um, the hat. And we have gunpowder. That's probably for crafting bullets, I would assume. Yeah, we're going to leave the cowboy hat on, though, for now. Okay, so now it's time to get some resources and do some basic things. Because we need to get fires going, we need to get cookers going, all that good stuff. Um, oh, there's another stone. We need loads of stone. Okay, so now we can craft um, the stone. I've, actually, before I craft the stone, I've, can I make an improvised axe first? I can't because we need sticks. And for that... We, oh, actually, can we use the hammer to hit things? Let me see. Nope. Ah, God damn it. Can't do that. Okay, so we need to waste uh, craft because the knife is pretty useless, really, but without um, the knife, you don't get the initial stuff, fiber, and sticks. Okay. Yeah, see, now we get the sticks and everything, and now we don't need the knife anymore because we can build a stone axe and an improvised stone axe. Okay. Let's go see if we can get more stone and more bushes. Oh, there was another gun on the bed. Okay, yeah, we're gonna check it out now in a second. Thank you. Sorry, by the way, whatever you see is about 10-12 uh, seconds after I've seen it because of the delay bet uh, for YouTube. When you stream, so uh, you might have to sometimes give me more directions because it's not real time. So when you say, oh, take a left here, that happened 10, 12 seconds ago. I wouldn't know what you're talking about. So what this makes sense, the bed in the house, yeah, that's not too long ago. Okay. Oh, there's another stone. I see another stone. So now we need to make an axe and then we need to get a tree to get some wood. Okay. Oh, there's another stone. So let's see what we have. We have 14, 14, um, and some stones, so we can make. Actually, we can craft the axe now. Improvised axe. Now we get the first problem with the equipping. Yeah, we have to drop this on the ground. Drop. Then we have to equip. And then we have to pick up the knife again so it goes in our inventory. Yes. Um, I think most of the problems with equipment would be sorted if there were just an able drag and drop. You know, left click, drag, drop. That would solve, I think, about 90% of the inventory problems that the game currently suffers from. I mean, it is an early access, so I don't care. It's fine, you know. It's just something that has to be noted, you know, these type of things. And now we can also use that axe for uh, the bushes, and that's why we don't need the knife anymore. Oh, come on. Okay, fine. Pick up the sticks. Okay, pick up the wood. There we go. Oh, 
Oh, don't tell me it's already getting dark. Okay. Oh, might as well get that bush here. houses. Oh, this is not the house we actually were at. Sorry, I'm in the wrong house, am I? Yeah, we're in the house next door. Okay, so now we need a weapon. Um, something long, I would say. So, I would start with an improvised spear, most likely. Oh, we can't. Um, stone knife spear? Oh, that's awesome. That's new, I think. I don't remember that. At least we make use of our stone knife. That's actually pretty sweet. And then we also need to make a drill kit. And that's it. So now... This is our weapon. Okay. Let's check out the bed quickly again. Oh, you were talking about the gun I probably already picked up. Unless there's another one on this bed. No, I don't think so. There's something. A pistol! Yes! Awesome! There was another gun. Sweet. So let's put that one away here. And we're full here as well. Let's put the bait in here because we're not going to use that for a while. Uh, yeah, this is the official part one of the playthrough. Can we do that? Is that as well? No. Where's my axe? Oh. Really? Okay. Thank you. So, um, the first one was kind of like a, a first look where we didn't really fully understand anything. So that, that world I destroyed. And if we're gonna die here now, we're gonna continue this world. So we're actually gonna try to get back to where we started all the time and um, in the moment I don't think there is some uh, such a thing as having a bed and saving your location so that uh, actually that's not true I think there's a thing that you can craft as a respawn and until we can do that we're gonna stay pretty much in this house and when we drive away or anything or go on loot runs we eventually will always come back here so that if we die we can just choose that location again as a start and um, you know then we'll be here again. So now what we want to do is we want to equip the hammer and we want to go to build and now we want to... Oh, we need sheet metal. Okay. See, that will be easier. Um, that will be actually quite easy, the sheet metal. There's a spawn point. You see, it costs two scrap metal. So um, that's going to be very handy. Actually, five sticks and wood. I think we could craft a trap outside. And then see if we catch anything. Um, where's my axe again? Oh, for God damn it! It is so annoying. <laughs> I, I really, like, if I get my hammer again, the axe goes back in my inventory. For Pete's sake. Yeah, inventory management is something they're seriously going to have to start looking at. Um, like, especially with weapons and tools. The the system they have right now is is just irritating because most of the time, especially when you get attacked and you quickly change in and out, all of a sudden your weapon is gone and it's in your inventory. It's like, oh, okay. Why? <laughs> 
So let's see, what do we need? Yes, we need sheet metal. So let's go and head over here and see if we can use our spear on the car. Not this one, but the trash car. Sandy, would you give it a rest now? Jeannie Mac. Let me just check if my wife is coming home because she's going out of her mind. There is nobody out there. Now sit down and stop. Stop. There's nobody out there. Leave it alone. It's just people walking past the house. And you know as well as I do, I open the door to let you out. You're going to be terrified that they come in. So... <laughs> Some stamina. Um, respawn, yeah, only needs to scrap until that's right. There we go. Yeah, no, she she's like she's quiet the whole time. Not a bother on her. I can't even wake her up if I wanted to. And the moment I start streaming, I don't know if she hears the sounds of the game or what it is. I have no idea. But she all of a sudden does that thing where she has her, her, her head up like a meerkat. And it's just she getting all nervous. Like somebody's trying to come into the house. It's like, no. <laughs> There's nothing there. Stop it. And where's my mouse cursor here? Yeah, actually, can we make that mouse cursor like bigger? That would be amazing. <laughs> Let me see. Um... Gameplay, mouse cursor, cursor size. Yes, please. And... Oh. Red. Okay, that's a little too big. Yeah, I actually can see this now. This is great. Because half the time I have it like somewhere on the edge of the screen. And when a zombie comes, I'm trying to turn around and I'm doing this. I'm like, shit, why am I not turning around? It's like, oh, here's the dot. Yeah. So I'm terrible with these with these uh, type of games in general. Um, okay, so now how much scrap metal do we have? Four. That's actually brilliant. So we can make a respawn point, I guess. Just to see what it looks like, let's craft one and put it right here in the garden. And we need our hammer, isn't it? Which is back in our inventory. Of course it is. So let's... Um... Oh yeah, there we go, set respawn. Okay, so now uh, let's quickly go to our car and drink. Um, oh, there wasn't very much. Okay, I'm gonna be a bit worried. We need some food as well. That only gives me 12 food. We had 67. We need some water. Now we had 94 water. Okay, so that was actually good. That was a perfect fit. Um, okay. I'm a litter bug. I just throw everything on the ground. Another stone, nice. Oh, 
I wonder if we craft a bed if we can sleep through the night. And we're gonna need nails to do anything, really. So the best thing is now, I wish we could destroy this. Oh, can we? No. Oh, maybe there's no sound here, so maybe we can destroy this now. No. Sadly, just the noise. Ah, well. Okay, so let's go back to the hammer. And let's build this puppy here. And put that right here in the middle of the room. It's fine. There we go. And because we had the um, drill kit, we were able to light it. Now, we don't have anything to cook, but, you know, at least it keeps us warm a little bit. Okay, so let's see what's what's next on the menu. So, um, for handcrafting, okay, we can do some basic things. I mean, we have a weapon now, so we can still make a stone and another backup. Um, weapon so that's fine but what we really need is the workbench and the workbench needs nails so we're gonna have to go into the house across the street to see if we get nails so let's see if we have somewhere good storage yeah so we can put some Fibers. that oh bait yeah that should go in the car did we oh yeah we looted everything in here See if there's a back door. Pick up the stones. Um, yeah, no, I know control uh, is between walk and fast walk, but every time I put things in the inventory, I have to press control to do everything in one go instead of one at a time or in little chunks. And oddly enough, when you're in the inventory and you hold down control, it also switches your um, walking. Actually, I re I remapped it by me. For me, it's not control; it's C. So C is that because I like my kneeling down to be control. So it doesn't. I don't waste energy. I think fast running doesn't waste energy. I don't like only running when you sprint isn't shift that wastes energy. But um, just normal walking, I don't think wastes energy unless that's too loud. I'm not sure. Like, it doesn't seem to make noise. Okay, we got a knife. Yeah, now the door is open. Oh, there's another knife. 
So I wonder if we can break these things down at some point. Yeah, we can always put it into our other house. Let's see if we can... Um, have some stuff we have a car battery okay. no more food in here so let's put the knives in here and we can't barricade anything because for that we need um, nails be so nice to do shift click of course stuck of two seriously <laughs> like unbelievable stack of two that is so small We're just gonna have to keep the stones on us, I guess. Okay, so um, I don't think we can sleep here at night. We can't access the bed, so let's save and then head out to the next building. So the next group of buildings is all the way down there. morning again so we just follow the road oh yes that is a nice weapon actually the crowbar Come on. nice now I have two good weapons Crowbar is lovely. Yeah, we need to find food. Yeah, I hope they are breaking down old furniture as well. Oh, that is lovely. Dirty water. Okay, we can cook that actually now. So let's consume... Or oh, with water, we can cook that actually as well. But... Oh, why is this white and this is red? Oh, because it's dog food. Yeah, so let's eat this. Yeah, now we're at 60. Very good. No, you're not getting any dog food, son. It's not for you. Okay, we're nearly there. Okay, let's actually be careful here. Because this is now uh, an area further away. Let me see, where's the first house here? I hate that my character turns. So, uh, the, again, this is just little uh, pet peeves of mine, yeah? 
when you turn your character, he looks in a certain direction. When you open the map, you see, oh, this is where I'm looking. And then I'm moving over here to have a closer look at the map and my character keeps bloody moving. It's, I really wish it, it, the controls were contextual. You open the map, everything you control is the map. You close the map, everything you control is your character. Uh, and I don't know, I find them a little bit too irritating sometimes because to me they're basics. They're, they're very basics. There they, are things that when the first time you design a map, you think about. In my, in my mind. They're not something that you do in the afterthought. They're like, no, it's actually the first thing I think of is when I do things. Shit, 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 shit. Is context, context uh, sensitive controls. Okay, what do we have here? Oh, duct tape, lovely. Yeah, I'm gonna leave the kitchen. I've have already too many. Stones though. Oh, he will, oh shit, he's a fast one. Oh, run, run, run! Get up, get up! Locked in animations is something I have to get used to. Also, another thing is when you hit twice. The second hit misses. So, um, that's one thing um, that you have to get used to in this game. When you attack something, even with ranged, I don't, with guns, I think with guns it's nearly the same. I, I, I'm, I think if you attack twice in a row, the second attack always misses. It's like the zombie is like in a state of, oh, I got hit, and you, it becomes immune to damage until it goes back again to its other state so it's really weird i've noticed that with every weapon so far that if you do one two the second one misses actually every attack misses for the next half second uh, until the zombie starts walking again so yeah exactly so this is i think it's a very high iframe driven game right now that uh, you have to do your attack slowly Wait until they walk again, attack again, and uh, you definitely get locked into your animations. So one of the things, unless they're fixed it, I would definitely recommend to never, ever, ever do when there's zombies nearby, is pick a lock. Lock picking is the worst thing you can do when you, when you have zombies nearby. Because after you open the lock, instead of the door opening or the car opening, your character is stuck in a three second, at least three to five second animation of just doing this. And zombies will hit you, nothing. No, you just will keep doing this and you will die. Uh, so be extremely aware of animation locks. So I'm just mentioning that for anybody who wants to play this um, to not be surprised. This is very good. Oh, golf club. Very good. Oh, I can't pick it up. Oh, I can, but they, okay. Yeah, we have to go back home and drop stuff off. Or is there a car actually where you can dump things in the meantime, like a chest, like, you know, like a, like a dump chest. Is there like a car here somewhere? Like there's a car here, but this one is one that we can destroy. So I don't think there is a car. So the closest car we have is the one here. And that one doesn't have much space, isn't it? Okay, it's better than nothing. Um, repair kit will be coming in very handy. We actually have to bring, definitely bring back the repair kit. Uh, duct tape would be great. To, actually, everything we want to bring back. So, but leave everything here in the car for now. That is very heavy. Oh, it's actually not that heavy. All these weapons are very heavy. And let's put some weapons here. Let's keep the crowbar. Actually, let's keep the golf club. Yeah, okay. Really? Where are you coming from? 
See that? You see that? Totally missed. Another thing that I wish they would do if I'm kneeling down and I hit the sprint button, I should immediately get up and sprint. If I'm walking slowly and I hit sprint, my character starts moving fast. It makes sense. If I'm crouching and I hit sprint, sprint is disabled. So when you're crouching and you're detected, I think it, it has to change that when you hit sprint, your character immediately starts getting up and sprints. That has to be a thing. Uh, but affect stamina used for crafting. Okay, so in this case, yeah, we need a drink, but a proper drink, so. So instead of crouching, I think I'm just gonna walk slow. So there's a couple of nuances, um, you know, to the controls, which I hope they're gonna address sooner rather than later. Okay, yeah, we're not gonna pick them up now, but that's good to know that they're here. Crisps are good. What is this? Ammunition, very nice. 50 cal. That could be actually for the weapon we have. Okay, let's see if the zombie sees us. Oh, shit. That is a glowing zombie. Screw that, I'm out. Oh shit, shit, shit. Don't want to special attack him because I think touching him will actually give me some kind of disease. So I didn't want to tackle him. Oh, batteries. That's for normal stuff. Okay. So I think it's time to go back to the house and then come back here for more loot. So that stacks nice. Let's take that. Let's take that. I think that's used for crafting, is it? Yeah. Um, so how much more room do we have? Three more? Okay, so let's take a couple of more things. <coughs> Stop it. Unless, actually, I think it <coughs> could be now. Yeah, she's, that's a different type of bug. Yeah, that's the wife coming home. Give me one second, I just have to let my dog out. Might as well do a quick save here. <coughs> Yeah, my apologies. <laughs> Just had to say hi to everybody. Get everything up to date. So let's go. Yeah, zombies, I don't think, yeah, I think they kind of hit the door and the door opens. I suppose that's what that's supposed to be with the door. But overall, I really like this game. Otherwise I wouldn't be arsed starting anything, yeah, um, with the game. Um, we need drinks. We need to go home very quickly uh, or find a drink. It would be great if we could find a drink. Um, that's food. Um, we couldn't, we, sleeping in a bed would be nice as well. 
So let me see actually here on the map. Um, so now which the way I'm facing. Okay, so we have to go back. All the houses are behind these houses. Now that was different. That was actually good because the zombie was kneeling down. Oh, give me a drink. Another repair kit, another hammer. Oh, this guy is a difficult guy. We can't actually... You see it says unable to grovel, so we can't grovel him. Oh, this works actually nice. Maybe it's the direction we have him in. That's awesome. Oh, that is a huge backpack. Can we... Can we pick it up? No? Okay, he's dead. Actually, hang on a second. I want to see something. If I put down this backpack and pick up this one. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is amazing. What a find. Okay, we're gonna have to go home because we're dying of thirst. Peanut butter. I keep finding all this food now. Okay, this house here, is, is that the one we looted earlier? Yeah, it is, yeah. Okay, let's pick up the stones, go home, make a fire, we cook that water. Don't want to run because that depletes our drink even further. So we haven't found any nails yet. Well, what is with this guy? Is that a lootable guy at all? No, then we should be able to destroy it. Actually, the repair kit, I think we can repair this car, yeah. Actually, uh, repair. Nice. And does that actually repair the things inside as well? I don't think so. And we need a kindling. So, I th oh, not this. So yeah, we need two of those, and we need, I think, a few of those. Um, I clicked all. Okay. Uh, it's two. It's two and three. The other way around. Oh my God! Can you let me click on the number? Uh, okay, whatever. Uh, it's just, just take everything every time. Oh, 
Okay, so we're at two water, so that should be good now. There we go. Okay. Um, oh crap, I of course. Right click is consume unless of co oh no oh no ah fuck ah balls fuck we're gonna die of thirst with the water right there Can I not destroy what I built? Um, let me see. Destroy, destroy. Repair? I don't want to repair it. I want to destroy it. so slow <sighs> I'm dying of thirst with drink right there God damn it, these stupid buttons with their drops. Perfect golf club. Um, is it two wood? I think it was two wood. Okay, we stay warm now. Let's put everything away. Oh, we have a glass jar. Why do we have a glass jar? That's from the peanut butter. 
it's actually pretty cool. to wait for the next morning. I think it's getting bright already again. Yeah, we need nails. Um, and for food, it would be good if we get into hunting. So how do we make a bow? We have a rope here. I think we need to make a bow on the workbench, so we do need nails. And um, we have two weapons, which are pretty low, so I would say... One piece of wood and five fiber. We can't really um, chase down the, the deer outside because it's too fast. So we have to kind of wait until we can make a bow. Um, we leveled up, so what are we going to do with skills? Um, I definitely don't bother with lockpick. Um, you can keep track of your friends' whereabouts. Less resources for building. Gift of the Garb. Um, there, Bowman. Oh no, that's actually just better accuracy with bows. Sprinter. Use less stamina while sprinting. That seems to me the most logical thing right now. Increased stacking of items. Definitely gonna go into that next. Yeah, we have to go out. We have to go to the other buildings. Now we have a good big backpack. Actually, the other side of the road is nothing. It's terrible. And we have a huge area down there, which is nice. And then we have another big building here, so. Should be getting bright soon again. A little bit further. Oh, Genie Mark, I love the sounds in the background. Oh, they give me fright there for a second. Okay, so this building here, we have to, we looted these two, we looted that, so now we have to do these three here. Oh, this is day one, I thought we already had night. 
the longest we survived. Okay, so now we are right where we need to be. Oh shit, what is that? Is that a tent? Can we destroy that? And get tarp? Sadly not. Oh, yes. Consume. You see, now consume is right click again. So I was complaining about con context, context sensitive controls that they should have them between the map and stuff so that when you're in a menu, your character doesn't kneel and get up. But um, this is context sensitive, but it's the wrong type of context sensitive. I suppose maybe it should always be E for eat when you're looking at an item or something, or E for use. Instead of right click and left click because it gets very confusing. Okay, there's actually one more building over there. I think. No? Oh no, it isn't. Oh! Rob Grave? What? Yes, where's the shovel? Let me make an improvised shovel. Actually, we can make an improvised torch. We have little rags and the alcohol at home. That is awesome. We can rob a grave. That is so cool. What does that mean? Hmm. Okay, crossbow, crossbow bolts. I don't know what we can do that for, but that's pretty cool. Okay. Oh, that's actually pretty sweet. Okay, there's some mushrooms here. Oh, there's loads of mushrooms up there. We can collect loads of food. But I think they only give us like two food or five food or something. Let's see, we're at 53. Consume, 52. 59, so they give us seven. Um, I don't know. I haven't played co-op. I think any game like this is uh, good in co-op. Because you can 
I, I don't know if it's split screen or whatever, but you can theoretically, one can start looting here, the other one can start looting there. You bring stuff back, so, you, and then you can just increase the loot um, that you find. There's a setting for it in the, in the settings options, whatever. So did we do this building here? I don't know. I don't think we did this building. Charm, okay. Oh, yes. And now we can mo make more rugs, but we can make rugs from fiber anyway, so it's okay. And that's it. That's all those houses done. So let's head up north or south or whatever it is and check out the cabin down there. Oh, stone. Always pick up stones. I just tuned in, never seen this game before. How the controls, uh, WASD, uh, yeah, WASD and Q and E for turning the screen, or you can use a uh, middle mouse button. You can change it in the settings, but it doesn't work as nicely. Um, so Q and E, if you get used to Q and E, it's probably best. And you can play with the controller as well. And then you can use the bumpers like for turning. Oh, there we go. Is that it? Yeah. Oh, another backpack. Oh, that's an... Oh, shit! I did not see this guy coming. Yeah, that was my bad. I did not see him coming. Oh, nice. Purifying tablets and dirty water. Oh, he was hostile. He was a person. Oh, baby. Machete. Thank you. He wasn't a zombie. He was a person. He just came to attack me. Okay, what an asshat. Medium plated weapon. Slot 4. Fits into pocket as well. Okay. Good. Get the crap out of him. There is so much food everywhere we find, but just not enough to drink right now. Yeah, drink seems to be a bit of a problem. Oh, okay. Okay. A tarp. Nice. We can make a rain catcher now, I think. Sweet. Let me see. Um, rain catcher. Yes, tarp. Four wood and a rope, and we can make a rope very easily now with ten fibers. Oh, that is sweet. Let's go home and make a, a rain catcher. What is this? Okay, before we explore anything else, so we explored this. We explored this, we explored this, and oh, we cannot put multiple. Mo oh, we can. Okay, big X right here. We did this whole area here, and did this area, and we did this area, and this is where we live. 
So let's go home. Make that rain catcher. Now I wonder how realistic is this game? Uh, will it only catch rain when it's raining? Or will it just fill up over time like it does in seven days to die? Also, I think the golf club has infinite uh, durability. I think. It's at zero quality, but it keeps smashing and it's not getting destroyed. So happy days, I'm not complaining. Until they fix that, I'm happy to just use my golf club and smash, head smash in heads. Oh, we walked past. The map actually looked at first scarily big like this, but it's actually funny how fast you get around. There we have some copper there. Some zinc. Oh, if we would have... Oh, is that gun we have a 50 caliber? Because uh, then we can um, kill the... Um, mobs let me see actually what weapon size the the gun is that we have found oh it's a point three zero eight yeah ah pity Let's put that in here put the batteries in here and keep the food on me Excellent. So it didn't use those clothings, which is funny because it says in the in here in the crafting it says you need any shirt and ruined clothing. So I wonder what it actually does is it starts ripping pieces of this, lowering its quality rather than destroying one item per tear. Okay, so that actually makes sense. Okay. Rain catcher, what do we need for it? Um, Tarp, a rope, and four wood. So let's actually let's build it, build it here in the front garden. Oh, so slow. So we have the tarp. Now we just get the rope and the wood. Four wood, is it? Okay, we have three wood. Yeah, let's actually take all of that out for now and put the food in here. Oh yeah, the tin we have somewhere else. Um, are we hungry? Yeah, 35 food, so. Cashew nuts, they should be good actually. We're up to 55 food again. But again, drink. We have no drink. So that rain catcher better do its job before we die.
Okay, we need one more wood. Let's get some more fiber and stuff. Zombies don't hit the like button. No, actually, we're doing really well. Thank you so much for everybody that's tuning in. And uh, if you're having a good time, please click the like button. That would be very much appreciated. Shares out the algorithm. No, no, no. Log. Here we go. Nice. Okay. Oh yeah. So how does this work now? Check rain collector. Okay, so I'm assuming we're gonna get three bottles here of stuff at some point. Again, I'm hoping, because it is so hard to find anything to drink in this game right now, that this will just fill up over time without it raining. That would be my preference right now. Um, we have so much food, we just don't have any drink. Okay, um, let's eat some crisps. We have no healing either. I don't think we can make any bandages, can we? Oh, of course, I didn't eat the nuts. I dropped them again because right click is dropping when you're not in the inventory of the cupboard. Okay, so now we're at 94. So we're doing very good on food. We're just doing absolutely terrible on drink. Um, okay. I don't want to take all that with me. We, we're running out of storage here. That's that's a big problem. We don't really need the hammer and uh, well we keep you know what we're gonna oh that's not what i wanted ah uh, i wanted to go in my inventory but anyway um okay. and i did loot all of these yeah okay. So let's have a quick uh, look around and head over here, which is the next closest thing. And that gives our rain catcher some time to work. Oh, another thing I want to do to see if it works is I want to craft some traps. We don't need the hammer for that. So five sticks and one wood. So let's, I guess, Put one here. Nah, that's overkill. Five sticks, one wood.
Oh, rocks function as bandages. Oh, then I can actually heal up. That would be sweet. That improvised axe is actually holding nice and long. I love it. Now we can leave those logs here on the ground. What was that? Bait, okay. Oh, bait, simple trap. Okay, so that's what we need the bait for? Okay, that's pretty cool. And we need more sticks. I think we get sticks from here as well. Yep. I don't, in real life, does my family have no. No, no, no. One wood, five sticks, we need one more wood, okay. Lovely. Loads of sticks. Okay, how much bait do I have? I only have two. I have a few more over in the car. And if we have five, then we can bait all five traps. Now, rain catcher, yeah, not working so far. It might have to rain. Oh, we only have four bait. Okay, that's okay. Actually, just in case we find some dirty water in the other house, I'm going to take these with me because I think we can craft this with two tablets and one water and we can just open them I think and they have tablets in them okay okay let's go and get some rocks as well our health is going down now we had 35 health because we have no water so we will die soon unless we can um, make actually let's craft some rocks from all the fiber we have See if that helps. We had 34, 49, nice. Okay, so the, as long as we have rags, 
we can prevent dying from thirst, I guess. Seventy eight, nice. It's going down actually quite fast. We had ninety two. Okay, let's take all of them and let's leave all of these here. And leave that here. Oh yeah, let's quickly have something to eat though. Yeah, we had a hundred food now. Okay. We need one more bush because the bushes have a chance to drop bait. Because I want to have all five of these things baited before I leave. There we go, bait. Okay, let's see. Oh. Okay, so do we have to keep Okay, if I say all. Oh, shit. Okay. Huh, that's interesting. I don't know if one is actually enough. So let's put two in here. And two in here. So I think you can just fill them up, I guess. And that's how many times you possibly can use them. I'm not sure. And we can't craft bait. Oh, we can from fish, of course, yeah. Okay. Anyway, let's go. Let's go. We're gonna head over here to this little area. Oh, shit. It's gonna be tough. Oh, no. I thought it was like a huge uphill climb. It actually is, like I said earlier, it's not that far. It looks kind of far, but it's not really... Um, Except we have to know which direction we go. Okay, let's go here, is it? About here? Yeah. Man, this is like loads of food. Drink, drink. No drink, all that food. Oh my God, stop giving me food and give me something to drink. Jesus game. Oh, 
Oh, that's for a pistol, I think. Very nice. I'm gonna take one of the hoodies. I don't know if I had any hoodies at home because once it gets winter, we need something warm. So a hoodie, actually, and the woolly hat as well. Take the woolly hat as well. It's good for insulation. That could actually be for the uh, handgun as well. Okay, I think that's it um, in this house. Not as much loot as I thought there would be in. Unless there's something here we missed. Oh, that's where we got all that f stupid food, yeah. Gonna have to keep topped up on our rags. Okay, so um, we did this house. Now let's see what we have right in front of us. I think it's right in front of us, yeah. Don't press H. I made the mistake today. Now I need to know what H is. Why are you telling me this? Now I want to press H. What is H? Car horn. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, I can imagine like... Oh, yeah. Oh, geez. Actually, show building health. Wow. Okay, that's pretty cool. Well, we need to level up, so we should probably consider killing a few of those guys. Actually, before they come in... Oh, quick, 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 shit, they're so fast! Yes, thank you. We had to get it of a dead zombie. Yeah, I'm not gonna take the knife. Gone. Now we get like no fiber and we only get sticks because I want fiber. Is that how it works?
Okay, can we loot loads of these cars? That would be great. Oh, nice. I'm strangling a zombie? That makes no sense, but okay. I don't think a zombie has to breathe. There we go. Head gone. See if we can find anything to get our car eventually started. Some loot here. This one looks like a car we can drive. Yes. Oh, it has no parts. Can't steal parts. Okay, we have oil. Um, let's eat some. Oh, a compass. Nice. Okay, we're actually full now. So let's see, and let's eat. No, we're fu we're 100 full. So let's see. Um, let's drop the wood. Let's leave the wood here, and let's leave the, uh, the, the bait here, I guess. Actually, let's leave the sticks here. Fishing rod, okay, I take it. And a pump action shotgun, holy shit. Um, I don't. Hmm. If I take it, I will pretty much be filled up. Okay, screw it, let's do it. Now, the compass, if you actually. I have to move my head over to the other side. Um, because the compass will show up on the left, and you have to kind of click on it and use. And it's oh now it's in my quick slot. Okay, so I go five, and now it's on on the top left, so you can see it there. Nails! Oh my! Oh no! It's matches! Damn it! I got really excited there for a second. Thought we had nails. Uh, tomato soup, I guess. Eat. It gives us drink. It should give us some drink. Yeah, fourteen. That's not bad. Food is fine. Um, let's leave the spanner here. Let's take the food. That's more important right now. Electronics, again, I leave them here. But... Actually, let's leave the bait in. Let's take these things with us. Uh, we can leave the mushrooms here. Uh, chocolate bars we take nuts jam Ugh. rope we can craft again very easily so let's leave it here everything that we can't easily craft i just want to take with me so i don't have to remember where i left important shit behind if you know what i mean scrap barbed wire i oof i take that i think i don't know if we can craft barbed wire I don't think so. Uh, maybe later on. More food. Crisp stack. Tomato soup. Yeah, immediately get that drink in. Okay, we got a rock here. Use that immediately to heal up a bit. There we go. There's a can here. Oh, a bottle of painkillers. Nice. Where is, it? Where is it? Oh, there. And I can open it, and that will give me painkillers. Oh, okay. Maybe they're stuck. Open it. Yes. Awesome. What do we have here? 
Oh, soda. Nice. Okay, let's go. Drink, drink, drink. Left click. Remember left click. Um, yep, and your guy whistle, if not in the car. Oh, thinks it's been handy once you get a hang shirt. Oh, yeah, if you want to lure them. Yeah, absolutely. That makes. Oh, here we go. T-shirt. And let's put this away for a second. And using this T-shirt, we can now... So let's actually see quality is 42. Quality is still 42, so it doesn't use up the t-shirt. That seems like a bug. So because I would imagine either it should use the whole t-shirt up, which would be overkill, but for each rag, it should obviously tear pieces out of the t-shirt only until it's gone. So it should lower the quality of it every time by like 10% or 20%. So that you can make like four times, you know, uh, rags out of it or something like that. Yeah, that, that would kind of make sense. And um, how many stones? Yeah, we have room for five more stones. So let's pick up some more. If there's no other zombie around, I'd just rather do that. Um, repair kit could be important again. Um, machete. Okay, come on guys, let's do it. So the compass only stays on for a little while. Oh, wow, big mess. The combat actually feels really nice once you got the swing of things. <laughs> Yeah, I think the golf club is just indestructible right now. That definitely seems to be a bug, but I'm not gonna give it up. No way, never happening. Okay, I think we went pretty much through every building here. Unless, yeah, we went through every building here. And we have no more room. Okay, good. Um, yeah, drinking is gonna be a huge issue. Um, so now we're going east and that goes to, to the road so we looted all of these can actually run quite a while so let's see what we have on skills why can we not get that less stamina used while chopping trees I'm not really too interested in that heavy weapons rifleman better distance home run increased damage to blunt weapons Increased HP for build structures. Catch a higher chance of catching food in traps. Yes. Yes. Thank you. Oh, 
shit. Okay, let's see our traps. Anything? So we're still supposed to bait them. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna have to get some more bait and then fill them all up, I guess. Um, no, no drain, no rain. God damn it! Is there anything we can stack in here? Um, the lick. Oh, the liquor doesn't stack. Oh, that sucks. Put the spanner in here. We have a circuit board that stacks at least. Yeah, all these clothes actually are completely redundant. Um, I'm gonna, except for the T-shirt, because that's what helps us make in rags. Are we faster in yellow shoes? T-shirt stays here. And... Um, let's put the barbed wire in here. Take that out. Let's put the oil in here. Take that out. Okay. Um, flatten the like button. Yes, please. If you could leave a like, it would be appreciated. Um, it, it is a, a little like Project Zomboid, but it's still in early access, so it has a lot of things that are missing, obviously. Um, so let's put this away, this because I don't think I need any of these clothes yet. Uh, now the hoodie, of course, is nice. Like this hoodie and this hat we keep for winter time. Okay, now. Um, resources okay we're gonna have to start finding nails soon and I'm gonna actually leave the fishing rod here oh yeah how many purifying tablets open six very good What do we need to make a custom torch? Actually, we have that. Because I don't know how long a torch actually lasts. So, uh, let me take that wood. And now we can make a torch out of the alcohol, one rock and one wood. We have two or three bottles of alcohol. I think we have two. Around and oh yeah put the weapon in there the shotgun thank you that is a nine millimeter so we actually now have weapons so I think that will be good for hunting so let's take the pistol out and nine millimeters let's see if we can reload the pistol we have 10 ammunition very good improvised torch there we go Oh, that looks pretty awesome. How long does it last, though? Still 100% quality, okay. Any water yet? No, nope, it literally will only collect once it's raining, I, I think. It's the metal. Yeah, metal stacks terribly. Um, food. 
food. That looks actually pretty awesome with the shadows. Dog food, I guess. Um, where did I put all the ammunition? I think it was here, wasn't it? Yeah, so pills, pills. Ammunition, ammunition, and duct tape. Yeah, there you go. Let's put the clothes in here as well. Repair kit. Um, yeah, put that in here as well. Okay. Yeah, water seems to be the big issue. Yeah, still nothing. Um, actually, we can put the drill kit here on the floor. I think things don't despawn. So we just drop it here. We don't need it right now. It's to light this fire we have here. Okay, so let's see, where can we go next? Um, I'm gonna walk right across just to see what this is. Actually, we're gonna go and get some bait. Let's collect a shit ton of bait so that we can fill at least one trap all the way up and see what happens. thrown the torch on the ground shit um, well do you know what we can actually throw the um, we can throw the spear out because I'm assuming the torch will be like a spear a big weapon Because the golf club seems to have infinite uh, durability, we're gonna um, leave the spear behind. So now if I do this, it's put into the inventory. Nice. Okay. Now let's find some bushes. Get some bait. Might as well pick all that stuff up so we don't have leave that lying around. Um, the reason I so far prefer this over Project Zomboid is I don't like how um, detailed Project Zomboid's sickness system is or health system is. It is frustrating. Um, and to a lot of people, this type of survival is a lot of fun. Uh, to me, it's absolutely not. Like, you get a scratch, uh, where, which is different than if you get a cough. And uh, I think it has some things in here. You can get hypothermia here. You can get a cough and a cold. 
But I think you just take painkillers and that's it, and you find them pretty much instantly, so it's not a big warp. Okay, there's no bushes around here now, is there? Is it like the magic forest without bushes? It's like the magic roundabout. Everybody sees colors and nothing's happening. What the hell? Um, Okay. Am I just walking past them or is there literally no bush around? Okay. Oh, there was just some loading lag or something. Well, we're nearly at the house. Wow, no, no single bush. What the fuck is that sniffling? Is that an animal? Did you hear that sniffling? Oh, it's raining. Nice. Our rain catcher might actually fill up. It could have been a zombie, but it did dangerously sound like some animal. And immediately I had TIE fighter dying dogs in my ears. Don't need another fishing rod. Um, well, doesn't matter. We might as well leave it packed. Okay, there's two of them. I know you can barely see, but I. It's like I don't have a choice. Okay. We're getting cold now, actually, with the rain, so we have to be careful. Oh, old cereal. Can we eat it? Nice, we're back to 100 is food. There are more planes in the water than submarines in the air. <laughs> I love it. This is disappointing. I thought this was a bigger building. They're wolves. Can you hear the sniffling? Oh, that's me shivering. Ah, for Pete's sake. If I could find a bush, I could get some fiber. It's the only forest that doesn't have any grass for miles. Oh, there. We're actually walking through one now. Good. I probably walked like past a million of them. I bet you I just c couldn't see them because it was dark. It 
So there's another set of buildings over here. We're nearly there. If I could see the animal, I would take my gun and shoot it in the face. Oh, there it is, but it's too far away now. Let's see if we can sneak up and get the meat or something. We have enough stone to make a knife, don't we? Stone knife. Because I think we need a stone knife to skin it. run off Now I can't find one. Of course not. Let's go back to the buildings. Hear it. it should be so close. I can hear it like right beside me. Ah, oh, there we go. We get it. That was a good shot. Maybe it bleeds out somewhere along the lines. If you. Oh shit! Uh, can we go to our last reload instead? Unless it's saved already. Yeah, that's my guy. He's cold. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, he had a boomstick, baby. I, there was no getting away from that. My pistol was good. I mean, from the distance, my pistol was better. Oh, look at that. Nice. Where are we? Yeah, we're right here. Okay, good. That's good to know. <laughs> Oh yeah, let's go east. No, east? Is it east? South. Guy had a bloody boomstick, Jesus. So there could be humanes in here. Can we turn auto save off actually? Because I think manual save, I'm more interested in that. Auto save off.
course. Matches, I need nails. Handsaw? What? Okay, cool. Can be used uh, as a weapon from your pocket's backpack. So, wood from logs. Okay, so we might get more wood from logs. Okay, nobody here. We can always run. Oh, shit. Yes, we got a fuel pump. Though this vehicle would be a hell of a lot better than what we... Oh, it has a full tank of gas as well. This is the baby. We should be bringing all our shit up here. This would make actually a great base if we could um, take this place over. These gates open and close, do they? No, they don't do anything. Fuel can, nice. Um, okay, maybe for trading. Let's see if we can find that guy again. There must be a camp nearby. Shit. Ooh, a desert eagle. 0 0.5. We have ammunition for that as well. Holy shit. Um, camo pants. Yeah. Don't know if I need that, but advanced gas mask. Yes. Shit. Okay, screw the axe. Screw the torch. Gun repair kit. Medical. Oh, the medical face mask. That's awesome. That prevents us from getting cold. So when we're in the um, in the in winter outside, we have to wear this. And we can actually wear this right now instead of this. There we go. I'm overburdened now. This is a very heavy thing, the fuel pump. Yeah, we're gonna have to bring stuff back home. Um, we will lose stamina now a little bit. This is an awesome place. We're going to have to come back here. There, now we see all the bushes that we walked past. Bait. Not 
Getting any bait. Oh, I didn't know I had a flashlight. Ah, oh, thank you. That's awesome. So I don't need that silly torch. We're walking in the wrong direction. We have to walk east. Stupid sense of direction up my ass. There is genuinely very little bushes here. Like, I don't see a single bush. Here we go. No bait. Still no bait. No food on me either now, so I have to be careful. I have to go home. Ah, oh, one bait. So bait is a very, very low drop chance. There we go. This way. There was actually so many more bushes, I walked past them in the dark going like, where are the fucking bushes? Bait? No, fiber. Oh, there's bait. Yeah, we have to go home after this push. Let's hope we got some rain catch, uh, rain caught in the rain catcher. Yeah, my stamina is going down now. Um, quicker when I'm running. Oh shit! Oh, I didn't see you! Ten stamina left. Twenty. I need fifty stamina for takedown. 
don't have 50 stamina. I'm staying at 25 because of my overweight, but I need to bring the pump home. Um, I don't know if trees or bushes regrow. I have no idea. Sorry. Oh, Humanity C Game. I didn't even see you popping in there. Uh, thank you so much for popping in. Um, yeah, we're having a good time uh, uh, with the game so far. I mean, if you go back to the beginning uh, of the stream, we, we do go over some things like that, you know, with controls and quality of life and all that. But uh, in general, it's very enjoyable. Thank you so much. I didn't look at the chat. I didn't even notice. Sorry about that. <laughs> So, yeah, we still need nails. That's the problem currently. Still finding nails. I don't think you can craft nails. Yeah, our oh, stamina has gone down drastically, but I have to bring that pump home. Uh, my Shadowrunner, you want to see is my new game to watch? Yeah, awesome. Thank you for the feedback. Uh, yeah, no problem. Um, So while you're here, one of the things that seems to be the case, I hate to say it because I'm enjoying it, is uh, the golf club doesn't seem to ever die, which is great <laughs> because I don't have to worry about weapons. <laughs> uh, but it's only fair, you know, to admit it. Uh, this, for some reason, it just won't die, the golf club. Um, meanwhile, the other weapons, I think they disappear when they have no durability left. Unless that's intentionally and the weapon just gets really weak because I did notice that we have to hit the zombies a hell of a lot more, but I thought it was because I'm out of stamina and I'm weak. So we got our pump now. Excellent. So now we just need a fan belt and a starter. Was that actually a fan belt? Or what does it look like? Is that a fan? Oh, no, that was gear. Yeah. Oh, zero durability weapons do terrible damage. Ah, okay. So because our spear broke when it was gone. Yeah, 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 yeah. That makes sense. Okay. So the I thought we were doing less damage with the golf club because of our weight. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. Um, how do we use that? Half empty gas can that still has usable fuel. Ah, there we go. And then if we find a funnel, we can siphon from other cars. That's true. Oh, it actually, yeah, that is. It's empty now and we can refill that then. Yeah, that makes sense. We found some really nice guns. Let's actually have a look and see what the rain catcher looks like. Oh, look at that. That is nice. Finally some water. That is awesome. Sweet. That is really cool. How much do we have left? Yeah, a few. Okay, so... Um, yeah, you're drying to thirst, yeah. So I have all these bandages with me because we couldn't find any drink at all. Um, so the bandages, I had to keep healing myself with bandages like to not die of thirst. Um, we have... Where's the other ammunition? We have a... Uh, Repair firearms. Make sure you ha have weapons in hands when repairing. Okay. 
how many of the the golden gun is awesome looking um, how many bullets do I have of that um, what does it need 50 cal 12 okay nice Oh no, it actually loses the ammo when you reload. Okay, that is something I have to remember. Now we learned that the hard way. Oh no, we don't. Huh? How, that's strange. Hang on. Gold Eagle 9 nine loaded, 3 left. If I click reload, it goes to 6 bullets and 0 left. Okay, that, that is very strange. Yeah, I think that's obviously um, not right. That doesn't look right. <laughs> so let's put the pistol in here. And what else do we have? 45. That's a three. Oh yeah, that's different. Let's take the other nine millimeter actually. Shoot some all nine millimeter. Which one is the nine millimeter we had now? That's the one with zero. Oh, zero as well. Okay, so it must have taken the. Huh? Why do I still have them? It's very strange. So it doesn't actually waste the ammo until you shoot. So it loads the ammo, but the ammo stays in your inventory and I assume you shoot it and then it disappears. Okay. Yeah, yeah, it looks like a book, all right, yeah, but um, that's fine. That, that doesn't bother me too much as long as the bullets work. <laughs> so, yeah, now it says I have 10 bullets, but uh, I took them out of the inventory. So, yeah, that seems um, a bit all right as well. Um, why are we still so heavy? Because of all the stone and the sticks, isn't it? Okay, let's put it away. Yeah, we're gonna have to keep going. Um, I think this looks like it's gonna be a bigger town here. And we might be able to find a, a, a hardware store there, which should hopefully give us nails. So this is all rural living. And this looks still like rural living. This looks like it might be a bit busier. So we should go up there next. Yeah, that would be amazing, actually. Like, yeah, cleaning up. Um, I mean, it shouldn't be overkill. Like, I shouldn't be able to destroy this and get, like, 4,000 things. But it would be really nice, especially with furniture, to destroy them and get, like, basic things like wood or sticks, but also have a chance of getting nails because that would make me go through all these houses and actually take the risk of destroying them with my axe, you know, the, the furniture. Um, even the beds and stuff like that, you know, and... Um, I'm assuming at some point we can hopefully craft beds and sleep through the night. That would be nice. I don't know if that's a thing already. I have no idea. I haven't gotten to that stage yet. Okay, we have two left. That's not bad. Let's put that in here. Let's put the 
sign here. Yeah, we don't need all the knives, but ah, yeah, it doesn't matter. Where's the knife gone now? There. Uh, we have for sale houses that are empty for you to build in. Yeah, that, that is pretty awesome, actually, yeah. Okay, so we're gonna take this with us in case we find a funnel. And here we have all the sticks and everything. Crossbow balls, let's put them somewhere else. Here we have stone. Oh, the sorting doesn't actually... Uh, yeah, okay. It doesn't actually sort, it just closes the gaps. Okay. Let's take some stones with us. Always good to have some. Put the pills away and then get some more food and then we're gonna have to go to the big town well i don't know if it's a town or not but definitely looks like a bigger place where did i put all my pills here there we go so nothing seems to be happening with these So I'm assuming that will just take some time. Unless they have to be completely full with bait, I'm not sure. Let's quickly eat something. Let's repair one more time. Now we're doing okay. Let's take one bottle of water with us. Oh. Yeah, good. We'll leave it there. Oh, empty jar. To bring it back. Oh, we need to leave the gun here as well. Uh, we don't have any more room here. Not the pistol, but the other gun. Hmm, oddly enough, the fridge doesn't have weapon storage, but here. <laughs> Only kidding. Um, that's good. Now we have more room. Yeah, see, now the bullets don't work, so the bullets are actually gone, so we have to take the bullets with us. Just in case. And, yeah, they're still here, but we need them in our inventory, otherwise this won't work. Let's also do a safe. And we're heading northeast, uh, northwest. We're heading that way.
Um, but the house does not have to co uh, the cook fireplace. And it's closer to the city, which has its own risk. Yeah, but we need nails. And I'm assuming we can craft our own nails, hopefully, at some point from scrap or from zinc or something. Um, and that the initial start of once you have a workbench, I'm, I'm hoping that we can make our own nails. Um, we checked these houses out already. Hey Jason, how are you? No touches indeed, yes. Okay, so let's see. So this one here looks actually more like housing or a farm. This one looks like a farm. We might actually find some nails there. I mean, it's a farm. They're, surely they repair tractors, things like that. There's a lot of DIY possibly going on on a farm. If it is a farm. Um, we should find some nails there. Probably a lot of zombies. <laughs> Yeah, so seeing that our t-shirt doesn't get um, broken, I should be able to take this off, craft our cloth, and then put that back on. Yeah, cool. And the quality is still the same, I think. Like, so early on, the quality didn't change. It does terrible damage, but it still, you know, it basically doesn't break. So... Stamina, 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 stamina. Sure, let's eat them. I love the sound of the shaking bag. That's actually pretty awesome. Okay, and let's walk around. Is there a door? Nope. Okay, window it is. some food here energy bar nice like think things like the chairs it would be nice to be able to take them apart and get like um, I mean there should be some nails in the legs so it would be nice to have some nails there chocolate bar fridge oh yes drink awesome Yes, dirty water. I love it. Is 
so we're finally getting some drink. Um, I, I'm not going to take these. I actually already have a good insulation hoodie and a hat, so that will keep me hopefully warmer for winter. Oh, cough medicine. That's awesome. Oh, I didn't know that was actually the other side of the room. Interesting, yeah. I have to keep turning the camera. I have to make sure I don't miss anything. So is there anything on the tractor that we can take apart? Guten Tag. How's everyone? Hidden truth. We get to states. Alles klar. Wunderbar. Is this building yes a funnel love it so now we can actually siphon fuel oh seed packets so oh yes we can make a second rain thing that is awesome okay I'm all for it yeah let's take the hammer as well screw it that is awesome that is all great but we need nails <laughs> Oh, where are the nails? So is that the only two buildings here? No, there's one across the street as well. And I have to keep you in practice with your German, even though I only know a few words. Don't want you to forget. Oh, man. Every time I go to Germany, people are like, your German is really good. How long you've been speaking it? Well, let me see. I've been speaking it since birth. <laughs> but thank you so much for t telling me that my German is very, very good. <laughs> oh, that is nice. Now all we need is... Oh, shit. Oh, now we're overweight again. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Screw it. We're gonna run home. A bear trap? Okay. Um, seeds? Well, we're gonna have to probably eat up or something. Let me see. We need some room here. Um, yeah, let's eat. Ah, God damn it. Did I eat it? Did I eat it? Yes, I did. Sorry, I thought I did something else. Um, let's take that. We actually have already a machete there. Ooh, what is that? A wrench? Good for a weapon? Large wrench. Okay. So, yeah, the chocolate bar, we didn't eat it. Uh, so let's eat it. This has been my TED talk on making the idiot out of, uh, out of yourself. Yes. There we go. Oh, this is awesome. We're completely overweight, but that's okay. That's okay. Let's do it. I think that's everything here. And with loot respawn turned off, we can just mark this now as done. I don't think there's anything else. But can we actually siphon fuel from cars that we can't drive? Like, as in lootable cars? Or can it, we only siphon fuel from cars that we can actually drive? So, which means, if you are on a map, if you play really difficult mode, like difficulty or something, then you would have actually only very little cars. So, where would you get fuel from? I'm assuming at some point you can craft it somehow. I don't know. Okay, so this is uh, Donzo. There we go. And now we're gonna have to go over there, but first we're gonna have to go home. We're gonna have to head south. South. It's the other way. The other south. There we go. We are so overburdened. We're running around with axes and crossbows. We actually, wow, crossbows. We have crossbow uh, um, arrows at home. 
like 28 we found this is awesome we can use that as a weapon now which should be very good when we find a deer hopefully it will be nice and quiet as well so if we shoot at the deer oh there's a rabbit oh no don't no oh you bastard where's the rabbit He stuck at the wall, that would be amazing. Stuck at the wall. And we can beat him with our golf club. Oh, he's gone. He's disappeared. He's smarter than me. Outwitted again by a rabbit. Oh, cool. There's another car. Let's see what we have. Can't carry anything anyway, but. A can of tuna. We're actually pretty full on food. Well, we can craft more rocks and stuff. We can craft more of these things. Um, yeah, we have lots of stones at home. So let's take the ammo. The ammo is important. Okay, let's stop. We have to conserve some energy. That bear trap is amazing. So I wonder if we can put it near our house and it just magically spawns a bear that walks into it. That would be pretty sweet. So we're not that overweight, so we're doing okay. There's our logs, okay. Yeah, I, unless I'm missing something, I don't know what I'm missing. Do I have to put it in like half half or something? So, hmm. I don't know. Very good. Seeds. Oh, okay. So we have to find more storage in the shed, I think. So is that now another piece? The fan belt. Oh, the starter. Nice. That's awesome. So now all we need is a fan belt. That is pretty sweet. Okay. It's a pity it doesn't have much storage though. Um. Oh, the hammer is considered a weapon. Okay. Um, we're gonna sort out the dirty water soon. Um, there's the crossbow bolts. And there's the crossbow. So now the axe. We can leave the axe here for now. Oh, look at that it immediately increases how much we can see as well that is awesome no it didn't I thought it did definitely hit the sign awesome
no that's where we store our drink end of story so let's cook um the other drink up oh we actually can craft it with pills or we can cook it i mean seeing that i have the drill kit here and the cooker we might as well cook the water there we go This is seeds, that's different, that's not food. This is medicine. So we have a gas mask and an advanced gas mask, okay. Nice stacked. Nice. And oh, this one we can bring outside. These ones we actually can bring in the car. So we need one one wood, I think, and two scrap or something, is it? One rope and four wood. One rope and four wood. for wood and the rope is made from 10 fibers there we go there we go nicely stacking might as well put the seeds away Actually, nice with 90. We have to put the bear trap down now as well. Hopefully, we don't walk into it because that would be great. So, let's see. Um, use. I can barely see it. I know I'm gonna be walking right into it. Ah well. Okay, one wood, four, one wood, no, four wood, one rope. Okay. Tarp. No, hang on a second. Um, yeah, fiber. I think it's ten, isn't it? it
That's fantastic. Okay, so we have food. So the next trip we have to make is somewhere there. And then I hope we're going to find a town or something, something bigger. I know it will be more dangerous, but we do need to find a hardware store and we need to get to learn the map. So every time we start here, we know this is housing. And if we figure out where the town is, um, so maybe we bring some food and some water and then we're going to say, screw it. We're not going to loot at all. We're just going to look what everything is is you know where's the nearest town so let's follow the main road here for example you know does it lead to a town i have a feeling towns are more center in the map so if we follow this road here we should come across the town hopefully eventually and um then we're gonna do more exploring in the next episode with, with some resources on us and that might be better than um, you know continuing to look because we have to find nails and i think the nails are found in a hardware store somewhere so okay and then we yeah we just got we don't have anything else here to cook so okay oh that's the battery oh the batteries are for my torch okay i didn't realize that that is actually awesome because there is some batteries that i have in the car and i didn't know what they were for and the next skill point then we're going to probably put under carry more weight oh no that costs three this costs one. Oh, okay can we undo this can we get the points back no okay Anyway, I'm gonna leave this here. This was pretty amazing. Um, I, I actually, I really like this game. The, the only thing right now that's really holding us back is nails. And that could be either my own fault for not trying to look for a town sooner. But I feel we had to sort out food and water. We have water kind of sorted out. The guns are just perks. We don't really need them. So uh, like the guys confirmed, you the only weapons that actually break are the improvised weapons that you graft, which is, makes sense. So once you find a weapon, uh, yeah, nails and boxes generally in garages. Yeah, but we looked uh, all the X's you see here That is what we searched um, I think we searched this one as well, but all the X's here we went and uh, Searched everything already uh, This place here actually we searched as well But there's some loot left I think but we did search it um, But there's no nails we searched this so everywhere here there were several garages no nails and we have our loot left on default normal so we didn't even lower the loot that we find so i think nails is something where they're gonna have to let us destroy some furnitures maybe and let us have a chance of getting nails i mean unless the workbench is so overpowered that once you ha get nails from furniture, it would be too much and you would basically, you know, fly through the game without problems. If that is the case, then I think the issue is not the amount of nails you get from furniture. The issue is then that there is probably too many recipes with nails instead of other things that you might need to craft first or find. But I don't know. I haven't gotten to the workbench yet, so I can't talk about that. But if nails are not overpowered uh, and a workbench is not overpowered, then, yeah, we should be able to get nails quicker, um, you know, from destroying certain furnitures. Um, maybe even until we find an, a proper axe. Say with an improvised axe, you couldn't destroy it. You have to find a proper axe. And that can take time as well. But we found two axes in three hours. Like, so that's, I think, would be fair. You know, to say, yeah, now you can destroy some furniture and um, get some nails. But we'll see. So I'm going to continue with this. I'm going to save it here for now. And um, we're going to continue with this again after, uh, after I think, maybe Monday or Tuesday. And yeah, or once you have a workbench, you can craft nails, I guess, with, with scrap, which is the cars you find. And eventually you're going to run out of cars. So you're going to have to mine zinc. You're going to have to mine copper. And you're probably going to have to make your own. Uh, resources then from there which makes sense because that is like any game like minecraft like anything first use the resources you have around you the the, the, cr the crude resources then use them to start crafting things that allow you to make resources um you know from scratch and so on and so on and then you rely on nodes you know copper 
whatever and you know you have to keep traveling the map and stuff so that makes sense absolutely but um yeah so far so good for an early access game this is absolutely fantastic um we we rarely see early access games come out with actually like working versions in the first place so this is actually a nice uh, surprise to see um an early access game actually you know delivering some content and not just uh, broken features like in all that you know so but anyway i'm gonna leave it here thank you so much for watching if you could leave a like on the way out that would be very much appreciated and i see you guys tomorrow probably i'm not sure if we're gonna see each other twice or once but either way have a good night and stay safe bye bye